Hi students, in this video we will learn what is civil 3D contextual tab and how to use contextual tab ribbon in civil 3D. As you know, AutoCAD uh, civil 3D, the ribbon is primary interface for accessing command and features. When we select any AutoCAD civil 3D object, the ribbon display commands and features related to that object in contextual tab. If several object types are selected, the multiple contextual tab is display. We will explore contextual tab in this exercise. For that, you need to download this drawing from the description link example metric if you have any other civil 3d drawing then you can use it for that exercise so when you will open your drawing we have many objects here alignments profile surfaces and parcels in this drawing select any parcels here acquisition seven when you will select your parcel you can notice that the parcel contextual tab has been display so where we have labels and table general tools modify and launch pad these are commands related to our parcels so with the parcel which is still selected now click a parcel line and you will see here when I select parcel line it will display the multiple contextual tab here you can see it's multiple contextual tab and here we have just general tools in this multiple contextual tab now use escape to clear the cancel our selections Okay. Reselect parcel by clicking one of the numerical label. Again, you can select your parcel and select the down arrow next to modify panel here. So it's a little trick that if I click here, then it will move back. So if you don't want to move back this panel then here you have a pin when you will click on the pin the bottom left corner of the panel here you can find this pin now you can select any other command properties it will open but you can notice that it is not going to back because you have pinned the panel that's why so when you will deselect your objects in drawing then it will go back where you can see here when I will press escape now it's go back so it's very important to know about contextual tab little things this was some uh, introduction of contextual tab later you will see more about them in the next